Factory. And we're going to talk about state of martial arts. And uh, one of the things I want to talk about in martial arts is conditioning. Because I get a lot of times people say that, um, like Burley's training with gloves, you know, this ain't real fighting. See, the thing with gloves is you want to train with gloves because you want to teach yourself how to punch with the protection so that when you take the protection off, you know how to punch. It's that simple, people. If you're not practicing with a glove, you're fucking your hands up. And this uh, segues into what I want to talk about as far as conditioning drills with, uh, in martial arts. Now, we see the um, karate's makarabi board. I think I'm saying it wrong with the rope around it. Uh, we may also see in kung fu, people sticking their hands in fire, hot rocks and breaking bricks. And Now, I want to say right now, all of this shit is bullshit. Breaking the brick is not going to give you a stronger punch. You know, or fucking up your hand doesn't make a stronger punch. So what they, what most people believe, if you fuck yourself up, you become a stronger fighter. Like uh, I met, I met one of the Master Little John students, and um, he showed me his knuckle. He had punched that Macarabi board so much that his four knuckles seemed to merge into one. Like the little grooves in between them weren't as defining, and it looked like one big knuckle. His hand was fucked up. Arthritis is probably going to set in when he gets old. Whole shit fucked up. So what I'm trying to say is, you do not fuck up yourself to try to fuck up somebody else. This is asinine. This is the, the, the you know, you know, you you start leaning into uh, foolishness, uh, little retardation. Nothing to put, nothing against my retarded people. You know, I say retard as far as people that can think smarter but don't. Certain people can't, you know, they, they, they have a, a, a problem. But for those of us that can and you still do something stupid, you are the def definition of retard. And so hurting yourself is not good. Even the Muay Thai and uh, the Muay Thai culture, a lot of those young dudes start fighting at eight. Their bodies are finished by 20, 25. Then kick the tree so much, numbness, all that. Also, there's no reason to break your body down for a victim. Just learn correct techniques. Learn what part of your bodies you can strike with. Now, there are some conditioning drills you can do, but keep it light. Do not change your body to hurt somebody because you think you're making yourself a weapon. No, you're fucking up your, you're fucking up your godly temple. And this is a beautiful temple. It can do a lot. And it's the correct conditioning that can help. So don't fuck yourself up to fuck up somebody else. Me, I love myself so much, too much. <laughs> I love myself a lot. So that's why I kick ass. I don't kick ass because I don't like you or I hate you. I kick ass because I love myself. You try it.